Hello, I am Renger Tom, and this is a quick demo video for After Effects script Bookmarker. So what is Bookmarker? Well, it's like your bookmarks in your web browser, except it's in After Effects. You can quickly access your favorite After Effects files with just a single button click. No need to go through all your folders to find that particular project you need. Just save it as a bookmark and you're ready to go. Okay, so once you install the script, you can access it via window, Bookmarker. And this nice little guy will pop up. Right now it's an empty list, I don't have any bookmarks saved yet, so let's go and save some. Alright, so for that, I have a composition, I have a project, something here, press save bookmark, and this little guy will pop up. Right now let's set the bookmark name, uh, next option is to save a screenshot at current time, so it will save a screenshot of your current composition. Alright, let's do this, we can write some comments here, testing bookmarker, that's fine, and let's save it. Boom! So that's how it's easy to bookmark a project. Now let me show you the script in action. Let's close the project. And let's select a bookmark and double click on it. And it will open up that project that is associated to this bookmark. Easy! 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 Right, so we have a screenshot area here. We have a path to that project where it links to. And we have some comments that we set when we were saving the bookmark. Cool! Let me show you some other options. This button will, uh, will open up the project. Awesome. Second button imports the project to the current project. So, like this. Let me show you in an in a empty scene. Import. There we go. It imported our project. Cool. Next one is save. And we already know how to use it. Another one is edit or replace bookmark. But for that, let me just open that bookmark and show you how you can edit it. Right, so let's edit. First option is link bookmark to this project. Let's say if I had another version of this project, bookmark demo 01 or bookmark demo 02, or some other project that I want to link to this bookmark, if I check this box, this current bookmark will link to that project. So it's basically replacing or changing the path to the file that you are linking. Well, that's easy enough. Set bookmark name, we can rename it if we want to. Let's say version two. If we don't have any screenshot already saved, or we want to have a different screenshot, uh, let me just show you. Let's invert this one. Click on it again. Link now bookmark version two. Replace existing screenshot. Testing. I uh, see replace screenshot. And let's save it. Boom. We renamed our bookmark. We changed the screenshot and we change the comment. Easy. Okay, moving along. Next buttons are to arrange the order of your bookmarks. Another one is to delete bookmark. Let me show you how it works. Select a bookmark and delete. First of all, you will get a quick notification saying that this bookmark will no longer be available for quick launch. That meaning it will be deleted from here. It will remove the preview image if it exists. However, it will not delete your original project file. Please note this one. Script doesn't do anything to your original project file. It doesn't rename it, it doesn't remove it, it doesn't delete it, it doesn't do anything to your original project file. Alright, so let's delete it. Boom, no bookmarks. Next one, reveal in Finder. To reveal something in Finder, we need to have a bookmark. So for that, let me just delete this ugly invert effect. Save my bookmark. That's fine. Save screenshot. And let's reveal it in Finder. Boom! It opens up a Finder where we have that bookmark saved. Easy! Another one is to import external After Effects files. This is a good one. Let's select a bunch of files and let's import it. It will go through all those files that you have selected and will import only After Effects files. Easy! And there's only one left. Settings. Remove dead bookmarks on startup will remove any bookmark that links to a file that does not exist. Let's say it was on your removable media, on a flash drive or, or somewhere else, or maybe you renamed the file, so that bookmark is completely dead, it doesn't open up the file. In this case, well, if this box is checked, then your bookmark will be deleted from the list. Easy. Show preview image and path to file. In case you need some space, we can turn it off. Alright, so it's gone. You can show it on. Easy. And show alerts when possible. When you delete an item, it will show you an alert that blah 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 something. 
and it will also show an alert uh, when the script is deleting dead bookmarks on the starter. If you just started to use the script, please leave this option on. So that's it. That's how Bookmarker works. Thank you guys. Cheers.